Not just because we don't know how to do it yet, because it's mathematically it's unsolved. It's built into the system. The system is chaotic. Yeah. Okay. Unless you make certain assumptions about the system that you would then invoke so that you can solve it. And so one of them is a small object around bigger ones. Another one, oh, by the way, in this solution with Jupiter out there, slightly tugging. Right. Yes. It turns out over a very long time scale, this is chaotic. But much longer time scale than Newton ever imagined. Okay. Okay? Because, yes, we are small compared to the sun, but Jupiter isn't. All right? And we're trying to orbit between them. Right. Right? So that's all. That's all. It's not deeper than that. It's not. Uh, yeah. Right? Yeah. I could have said the four-body problem, but this problem begins at the three-body problem. Right, right. Because you're going to have the same thing in the four bodies or exactly. five bodies. It it's going to be the same. And we have star clusters with thousands of stars right. in them. Exactly. And they're all just orbiting. orbiting. You, we, we, have to, we can model it, but we cannot predict with precision where everybody's going to be at any given time. Okay. Because it's chaotic. The chaotic. So it's basically it's about the chaos. It's about the it's chaos. It's all about the chaos.